This is 1,300 pounds of black Angus beef, and it's going to be sold at the Cascade County Livestock Show and Sale. And I met with one 4-H'er who's really, really excited about selling this big fella. It's sale time in Cascade County, and 4-H'ers are gearing up for the Cascade County 4-H Livestock and Show event on July 8th and 9th. Hudson Rohr, a Circle S beef member, is no exception. Uh, he's one of the better steers, actually. I mean, when he started, he wasn't so great, but... Uh, he just became easier and he gentled. He became a lot gentler in the past couple of weeks and he looks really good compared to what I've had in the past. The livestock show contains events for beef, sheep, goats, swine, poultry, and rabbits in market, showmanship, round robin, and supreme breeding female classes. And Hudson Steer weighs 1,300 pounds, right where he wants it to be. Uh, well, for market, I think we'll do pretty good. I, for the past, four or five years I've always ended up in the top ten for my steers. And showmanship may be a challenge for Hudson. He's got a banged up arm, but this veteran showman is up for the task. He shared what the judge will be searching for come sale day. He's looking if he's strong over the shoulder and if he's square over the hips, but uh, I think most, mostly what they're looking for is that he's got a wide rump and uh, he doesn't cut too much up in the flank because that means that he, you're getting rid of that the tenderloin right here and there's less of it. And we had to make our conversation quick. This 1300 pounds of black Angus was getting on me. Yeah, maybe I won't quit my day job just yet. This livestock auction is a great opportunity for kids to learn about the finances of agriculture and Hudson shared a few thoughts. Uh, yeah, well, the just the sales have been getting a lot better over the past few years. We've started doing online uh, sales along with our in-person ones and we're just getting a lot more buyers from even around the country. I think last year we had buyers from Alaska and Oregon and all over the place but especially our local buyers they're a lot more are coming out and businesses are buying for their employees and uh, it's just a big opportunity for youth to be able to learn how to run a business basically but in an ag way. In the cattle pen, Ryan Gamboa, MTN News.